Good morning, good morning, everybody, and welcome back to my channel. Thank you guys so much for watching my channel and subscribing to my channel. And thank you guys so much for your comments as well. I love comments, guys. I love comments because they um they let me know that this is resonating with you guys. If you are watching this from TikTok, after the first 10 minutes of this video you're watching, you're going to need to go over to my YouTube channel at Jay the Oracle so that you can see the rest of the message, so that you can hear the rest of the message that Spirit has for you, okay? Guys, I will leave my link posted at the bottom in the description box if anybody would like to book a personal reading. I do personal reading specials on Mondays and Tuesdays. I have Minute Mondays where you can test me out for just a dollar a minute. The minimum is 10 minutes. The maximum is 30 and then on Tarot Tuesdays, I give $10 off a one-hour reading or a 35-minute reading as well. And you guys can check out all of those prices and everything in those booking appointments on my link. Today, this is going to be a general reading for my Capricorn Nation. So, guys, if you are a Capricorn or you have any Capricorn in your birth chart, this is going to be the reading for you, okay? So, we're going to go ahead and tap on in. And see what messages that spirit has for you guys. Also, guys, keep in mind that these are general messages. So, they could resonate with you completely a little bit or not at all. And um, if it does not resonate with you, then just take the things that do resonate with you. Ignore the things that do not. Personal readings are always good because a personal reading is going to resonate with you completely, okay? All right, let's go ahead and get into it, y'all. Spirit, what is the energy surrounding Capricorn today? Show me clearly, please. Thank you, Spirit. So we have giving and receiving Capricorn, okay? So you guys have been doing a whole lot of giving. You know, you help everybody. You do for people. You help people that's in need. And now Spirit is going to bring that back around to you. And you're going to start to receive some blessings. Because you've been blessing other people. Or you've been a blessing to someone. And so now Spirit is going to turn back around and return the favor for you. Okay? Good karma coming to you. Spirit, what else does Capricorn need to know? Show me clearly. What do they not see coming, Spirit? What's in store for them? What do their souls need to know? Show me clearly, please. Thank you, Spirit. All right, so we have the dragon. So you guys um, are going to have to have strength and, and wisdom about something. You guys do have a lot of strength and a lot of wisdom, okay? I just heard use it. I just heard use it, okay? And Spirit wants you to know that forces beyond your control are going to intervene with something that's going on, okay? And for some of you guys, Spirit is going to intervene with something that you have going on with the water sign, okay? Um, this water sign is not letting their intentions be known, okay? This water sign is not letting their intentions be known. But Spirit is going to shield you from that. Y'all see that? So there's a water sign that's not letting their intentions be known. So somebody could be dealing with a Cancer Pisces or maybe a Scorpio, but they're not letting their intentions be known, okay? So this person has definitely has a, a hidden agenda, and Spirit is telling you that you're going to need to follow your intuition with that and, and be strong and use your wisdom because you guys are full of strength and full of wisdom, okay? Uh, for somebody, you've given a whole lot to this person. You've helped this person a lot. You've done a lot for this person or something like that. But this person is uh, not letting their intentions be known. Okay? So just be mindful of that, you guys. Just be mindful of that. Let's see what else is going on. Spirit, tell me more about the energy surrounding Capricorn, please. What does Capricorn not see coming, Spirit? What exactly... Do their souls need to know, Spirit? Show me clearly, please. What does Capricorn need to know? Thank you. So, we have thief here. Okay? So, for somebody, you in your recent past, you suffered some type of loss or you feel abandoned by this person. Okay? For somebody, this person may have ghosted you or disappeared on you or something like that. Um... And for somebody, you, you're missing somebody or you're missing something. So this person 
could have stolen something from you. For some of y'all, this person could have stolen your peace of mind. Somebody could have stolen your heart. Somebody could have stolen your happiness and your joy in this case. And, um, yeah, this person is water sign person. This person is an energy vampire. This Cancer Pisces or Scorpio that somebody could be dealing with, this person is an energy vampire, okay? This person is sucking out of the positive energy out of you, okay? Like I told you, you guys have lost something. For some of y'all, it's your positive energy, your happiness, your, your love, and your joy is what this person has taken from you, okay? And this person has hidden intentions, and you didn't see this coming or something like that. Okay, somebody's also going to be gifted with money is what you don't see coming. And I also just heard that this person, this Cancer Pisces or Scorpio is broke and they don't have any money. Okay. Spirit, tell me more about the energy surrounding uh, Capricorn, please. Show me clearly, Spirit, enlighten me on what Capricorn needs to know. Thank you, Spirit. You see that? We have half truths. So somebody is telling you the partial truth about something. You need to get more information. Somebody's telling you some white lies and you're missing part of the story because they're trying to cover it up, okay? If someone told you a bald face lie straight to your face, a well-intended lie, you see that? Somebody's not telling you the truth about something, okay? Somebody needs to let their intentions be known. All right, somebody around you has some type of hidden intentions and it's a water sign for some of y'all, okay? You guys are going to be gifted with money. Didn't I tell you guys that you've been doing a lot of giving to people and helping people and stuff like that? And Spirit is going to return that favor by letting you start to receive. And for a lot of you guys, you're going to be gifted with money. You're going to get a sudden financial change or a windfall of money, you're going to get an increase in your money or you're going to win some money or something like that. There's going to be a quick turnaround, okay? So somebody has money coming. You're going to be gifted with money. And for some of y'all, this is your sweetheart that's doing this to you. The, the person that you're in love with, um, you know, you, you are devoted to this person. You had good intentions for this person. You're in love with this person, but this person is hiding something from you. Your sweetheart is hiding something from you, okay? There's something they're not saying. Spirit, tell me more about the energy surrounding Capricorn, please. Thank you, Spirit. All righty. So for some of you guys, this is a woman. All righty. For some of you guys, this is a woman that stole your happiness or stole your joy or something like that. It's a, it's a whole female woman. And she could be a Taurus like you. I mean she could be a Taurus. Not a Capricorn like you. But she could be a Taurus woman. For somebody this is a wife. Or maybe um, a friend. Or a girlfriend. Or for some of you. This could be a friend. Just a regular person that you are in a platonic friendship with. Okay. But this person has stolen something from you. Just the same. Or you, you, you recently met this person in the past. But you don't really know this person's intentions like that, okay? Somebody is a thief, okay? Because they broke as a motherfucker. Spirit, clarify half truths. What does Capricorn need to know? Thank you. And I also just heard for somebody, you are a Capricorn woman dealing with the water sign man and he's not letting his intentions be known. And this man is draining you. He's draining you of your positivity. He's stolen your positivity. He's stolen your happiness. He's stolen your joy and he's stolen your peace because he's not letting his intentions be known and he's telling half truths. He's, he's lying about something or telling you the partial truth about something. But just the same, um, this person that's telling you these half truths, I'm getting that you must have walked away from this person in the past because they kept lying to you about something. They weren't telling you the full truth about something. And so it caused you to have to walk away and leave them because you couldn't get the truth out of them. So in the, in the, in the present time, this person has probably reached out to you wanting to work it out or work on it or something like that. Um, they're wanting to rebuild something with you, but you can't really trust this person because it's something that this person was, was covering up. Okay, they told you the story. They told you what was up, but they left some information out of the story. They withheld some information from you. So that's why 
they still a motherfucking liar. Because if you're withdrawing the truth from somebody, you're not telling the truth and you're keeping something from somebody or you're hiding information, it's still the same thing as lying because you're not telling something that you supposed that this person wanna know. So you still lying. Okay. For some of y'all, it could be a fire sign that you're dealing with, maybe an Aquarius, uh maybe an Aries, maybe a Leo or a Sagittarius. Spirit clarify gift of money. Thank you. So we have coffin here. So there's going to be a completion to somebody being broke. This is going to be a death to um, poverty or not having any money. There's going to be an ending to your financial problems. There's going to be an ending to your poverty. There's going to be a completion of that. You guys are getting ready to go through a transformation as far as financially wise. Because you've, you've been having a little bit of money problems. And for some of y'all, y'all been having money problems because you kept giving and giving and giving and giving to other people with these hidden intentions. And that's why you've been having money problems right now, okay? Y'all guys need to remember that you don't have to help everybody, okay? Just because... Somebody comes to you for help, that don't necessarily mean that you have to help every single person that comes your way. Because most of these people that's needing your help are people that's, that's, that you're pouring into and these people are not pouring anything back into you. So you don't have to help people. I don't know who needed to hear that, but, but you needed to know. Spirit, tell me more about the information surrounding Capricorn, please. Show me clearly. Enlighten me on what Capricorn needs to know. Thank you. So we have earned. So somebody's getting ready to experience, somebody in your recent past, you experienced some type of financial prosperity. You experienced some type of good changes in your life. Spirit wants you guys to know that you have a long life ahead of you. And also somebody has some good news coming about something. Okay, you guys are going to be living a new life. You guys are going to be living a new life. So, so in the recent past... Somebody tapped into some, somebody already tapped into this money right here in your recent past. But for others of you, you're going to tap into this money in the future. If you have not already tapped into this financial prosperity and these good changes, you are definitely going to tap into this in your near future. Definitely. You see that? The coffin card is here. That means that there's going to be an ending to whatever money problems that you're having. There's going to be a um, completion to your poverty. There's going to be a completion to your financial troubles, okay? So if anybody is on here watching this and you're worried about some money, Spirit is letting you know to hold what you got because they're getting ready to come through and assist you financially if they have not already, okay? Spirit, tell me more about the energy surrounding Capricorn. Thank you, Spirit. So we have Olive Branch. Like I told you, this person that's been telling you these lies and they weren't making themselves quite clear on what they were talking about or what they had going on. And you walked away from this person because of that. I told you that this person is going to come back in your present time. For somebody, this person has already come back wanting to work on it, wanting to fix it. You know, wanting to try to do whatever they can to rebuild it. This person wants your forgiveness. This person wants to. Uh, this person wants to come back in a peaceful manner. Um, for some of you guys, this is a family member. Um, that's that that told you to have truth about something. But just the same on another note, you guys definitely have tapped into some success in your present time. Okay, because for somebody in your past. You, you tapped into some financial prosperity and you had some good changes in your life. You got some good news that came towards you and it made you very successful. So for somebody, this could have been like a new job. You got some good news pertaining to a really great job that's paying you some good money and you have great benefits. For others of you, it could be a business opportunity that you may have ran into in your recent past. But just the same, in the present time, it's making you very successful. You're experiencing that success. If it hasn't already come towards you, it's on the way and you will have it in the future. You will definitely have it in the future, no doubt. Yes. Um, Spirit, clarify coughing. What does Capricorn need to know, Spirit? What is the message? Thank you. So we have open door. So for somebody, 
you don't have your door open because it's in reverse. Somebody's moving around and around in circles with this person that they're dealing with that's not making their intentions be known. This water sign that's not letting their intentions be known. You're moving in circles with this person and you're not getting any change from this person. You're feeling stuck or trapped with this person. This person leaves you feeling unsure about a whole lot of things, okay? So you can't, you, when this person came back into your life, you know, they want to act like they want to work on it, but this person's still lying about something. I don't know what it is, but you know it too, because this person makes you feel unsure a lot. You always feel unsure when it comes down to this person. Spirit is saying that you need to seek advice from other people. And you need to focus on more important things, okay? And what you guys don't see coming is that this door, this door right here is closed. Because you see how it's in reverse? And then you see right here, the door is closed, okay? So for what you don't see coming is that this person keeps making you feel unsure about something, okay? And also what I'm hearing is that somebody is lying about money. Somebody is telling you somebody is telling you lies about money. Somebody wants you to believe that they don't have as much money as they want you to. Somebody acting broke so they don't have to give you anything, okay? Yeah. And you're going to end up shutting this person out. You're going to end up having to reject this person because this person is lying to you about something. But for some of y'all, this is money that this person is lying to you about. So this is somebody you're in a relationship and your, your person, your spouse, they're lying about money. And somebody stole some money too. That's what I just heard. Somebody stole money from you and they're lying about it. Somebody stole money from you. And they're lying, saying that it wasn't them, it wasn't them. They wouldn't do nothing like that or something. Or oh, this person knows who did stole your money. This person knows who it was and they're not saying anything. They're not saying anything. Spirit, tell me more about the energy surrounding um, Capricorn, please. I don't know why I want to keep saying cancer. So for somebody, because I keep hearing cancer over and over to the point where I'm about to say cancer. For somebody, you're dealing with a Cancerian person. And that cancer is the person that stole from you. That cancer is the one that's telling you have truths. They either stole it or they know who stole it and they're not saying anything. Okay? Yeah, somebody stole your money. And they know. It was either them or they know who did it. Spirit, tell me more about the energy surrounding Capricorn, please. Thank you, Spirit. Okay. So, like I said, you guys experience financial prosperity in your past. You guys are, are being applauded and cheered on. You guys have a lot of support and encouragement in whatever it is that you're doing that helps you to gain this financial prosperity, okay? You have people in your life that's gassing you up and they're backing you up all the way, okay? These people support you. They encourage you. They're, 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 they're applauding for you. They're cheering you on. These people want to see you make it. So I think that's great. When you got people in your corner that really want to see you make it, that's, that's beautiful. All right? That's beautiful. Spirit, what else does Capricorn need to know? Thank you. Yeah. You guys are, are very, very successful at something right now. Okay? You guys are very, very... You're succeeding in something. Okay? And for some of you guys, you have some competition. And I'm getting that this is either at work or in business. But just the same, you're about to dominate your competition. You're doing it right now. Everything that you're doing is on point. And Spirit is saying that you guys are doing an amazing job. And that's the reason why you have all of this success coming here and all of this uh, financial prosperity that I see and all of these good changes because you guys are working hard. Okay? You're slaying it. You guys are working very, very hard on your job or in your business, okay? And for somebody, you're in competition with somebody else that, well, this person is in competition with you, but just the same, you dominating your competition, okay? So whoever is competing with you, they ain't winning, all right? Let's see what else. Spirit, tell me more about the energy surrounding Capricorn, please. Thank you, Spirit. Yeah. So we have love bombing. That's this person. 
that's this narcissistic ass person. They're going to come back in the future and want to shower you with attention and influence your behavior. And then they're going to try to manipulate you. This person has hidden intentions. I told y'all I can't make this shit up. This is double clarification that this water sign right here has hidden intentions. Y'all see that? This person needs to let their intentions be known. But forces beyond your control is going to intervene with this, you guys. You guys are going to get the truth about this. But just the same, Spirit is letting you know that this person is manipulating you. And you really need to go ahead and close the door on this person because they're a liar. I'm going to get more clarification for you guys in a minute, okay? Because I want to understand, okay? For some of, some of you guys, you're, you're going to end up leaving. Okay, and for some of y'all, y'all just can't deal with the situation. You don't really know what to say or do because you can't comprehend what the fuck this person is talking about because they keep lying. They're speaking in riddles and they're telling fucking lies. Let's get some, let's get down to the nitty gritty. I'm going to pull out the tarot deck now. Spirit, what is the energy surrounding Capricorn, please? Show me clearly. What exactly does Capricorn need to know today? What do they not see coming, Spirit? What are you trying to tell them? Please show me clearly. What are you trying to tell them, Spirit? What exactly do they need to know, Spirit? Thank you. So you have the Three of Pentacles in here. Somebody's not learning from their mistakes in the past, so you're not trying to learn. Somebody's very overwhelmed right now because you don't know what the fuck to do with this person. But what you don't know about this person, Capricorn, is that this person is very lazy. They have poor worth ethics. They don't have any determination or commitment. They don't have the concentration and the dedication that they need to be able to achieve goals in life. They don't even have any goals set for themselves. I think this person's intentions are to use you for your money. That's why we have thief here. Okay? Because this person is going to try to use you for money or this person is using you for money. For somebody, this is a woman. You're a Capricorn man and this is a woman that's using you for your money. Others of you, you're a Capricorn woman and there's some dude that's trying to use you for your money. Or something like that. Yeah, this person is definitely trying to use you for money because they're lazy as hell. Okay. Clarify the three of cups in reverse, please, spirit. For some of y'all, this is a Taurus, like I said. Or it could be another earth sign like yourself. Spirit, clarify the three of pentacles. Yeah, you see that? The four of wands in reverse. There was a breakdown in happiness and harmony in the home, okay? There was tension in the home between you and this person. For some of y'all, this was a family member or a loved one. For others of you, this is somebody that you was in a relationship with, okay? You're not getting any love or support from this particular family member or your person that you are dealing with, okay? Other people are showing you love and support and encouragement, but that one particular person is either your family member or the person that you lay next to. But one of these people... Or not showing you no love. Okay? And you're feeling unsure about this person. Okay? You're unsure if that relationship between you and that person is solid. You don't think it is. Okay? You guys have the six of swords at the bottom of the deck. So what you don't see coming is you're moving into troubled waters. Okay? Somebody is feeling very, very stuck. Or very, very trapped in a situation with whoever this is that you're dealing with. Okay? Somebody's going through or going to be having a stormy relationship. All righty. And this person, you can't trust them. They're just a fucking liar. All the way around the table, you can't trust them. Spirit, clarify the four of wands in reverse. Yeah, justice is here. So, yeah, this person that's doing this to you, robbing you of your happiness, breaking down your happiness, causing all of this tension with, uh, between you and them and, and all of that kind of stuff, trying to use you for your money and shit, sack chasing and shit. This person's going to be judged. For, they're being judged for what they did, okay? 
and you've been wronged by this person and spirit is letting you know that they're going to deal with this for you. You're going to get justice for what this person has done to you. This person has wronged you in some type of way. This person has caused you pain in some type of way and spirit wants you to know that this person is going to be held accountable for their actions. The truth is going to come out about what this person has going on. Spirit is also saying that your attention is needed for something. You need to learn the whole truth about somebody, okay? And the whole truth that you need to learn is about this person over here in your life. This Knight of Wands in reverse right here, okay? There's a Knight of Wands at, in reverse at the bottom of the deck. Yeah. Spirit, tell me more about the energy for Capricorn. What is the message? You got the King of Pentacles in reverse. This is an ungrounded man. Or this is an ungrounded woman with very masculine energy. This person is corrupted and you can't trust them. This person is disloyal. They broke as hell, like I told you. They're very ruthless. Unstable. They're a slob. They're lazy. They're bad in business. They have poor judgment. This person could be a younger person than you as well, but this person is broke as fuck just the same. And I'm also getting that this person is a gambler, which is the reason why somebody can't, why your money came up missing because this person lost all their money in a dice game or gambling or something like that. But this person is definitely a gambler just the same, okay? And this person is an unsuccessful person. This person takes a whole lot of unsuccessful risk and they always find themselves in some type of financial bind because they keep making these off the wall ass, risky ass money the fucking um decisions okay this person is a complete fucking deadbeat this person is also a hypocritical cheater this person is a fucking cheater and a liar and they hold everybody around them to standards that they can't even meet their own motherfucking self so for somebody this person is lying about because when you have thief on the table this is about somebody lying sucking the energy out of you this is about somebody um They're stealing from you. And that's what this person is doing. They're stealing from you because they're using you. This person lies, cheats, they're corrupted. The king of pentacles in reverse is not nobody that's a good person. All right. Now, if it was upright, okay, different. But in reverse, the king of pentacles is not a good man. It's not a good man. And if you're this Capricorn woman right here that's dealing with this uh, king of pentacles right here, you need to go ahead and remove yourself from that person's life, okay? You got the two of pentacles at the bottom of the deck. You see that two of pentacles right there? This person's juggling you. When the two of pentacles come out upright, this is about juggling. So not only is this person using you for money, this person is using your money to go look good for somebody else so they can spend money with somebody else because they're juggling you and other people. Clarify the king of, the king of pentacles in reverse spirit. What does Capricorn need to know? Thank you. The Knight of Cups here. So this is a water sign. And this person, like I told you, they're going to come back for somebody they already did. This ungrounded ass, corrupted ass, disloyal, broke ass motherfucker that's very ruthless and a cheater came back and tried to offer you some type of proposal. Okay, this person's getting ready to come back and take action for somebody this person already did. Okay, spirit is saying you need to follow your heart on this. Some of y'all, y'all already know this person lying and, and, and sneaky and you already don't trust them. So, I, I mean, you know, like I said, I'm just the messenger. But spirit is saying that you're going to need to follow your own heart. All I can do is tell you what I see. The rest is up to you, Capricorn. Okay, this person is going to come back around you, love bombing you. I told y'all that this person is going to come back and love bomb you, but they're really going to be with hidden intentions and they're going to be manipulating you. They're going to come back around. They're going to come back around and pretend to be this charming man, trying to be romantic and acting like they care, trying to be chivalrous, want to open up your doors and pull out your chair and all of this shit. Want to try to come back and sweep you off your feet so that they can use you. This person is a user and a liar. 
For some of y'all, it could be a man. For some of y'all, it could be a woman. And just like I said, baby, I can't make this shit up. You have the page of swords in reverse at the bottom of the deck. I told you, this person is going to come back being manipulative with hidden intentions, trying to act like that they want to be this old, kind, charming person. But in reality, you're going to get some bad or disappointing news about this person. Okay, and you're going to come to this person about this news that you got and they're going to be very defensive and they're going to start to play mind games with you. Okay, this person is very malicious and this person is very sneaky. Okay, and some of y'all have y'all head might have y'all head in the clouds about this person. Okay, and you may have nothing to say to somebody at this moment. So right now with this moment, you're not talking to this person, but this person is going to come back around you just the same. And they're going to try to love bomb you. They're going to try to get you to fuck with them again. And they're going to be buying you stuff and doing all of these cute little sweet little things for you. But until once they get your ass back where they want you and they back got control or they feel like that they got some type of control over your mind, they got you back in that same state of mind that they had you in. They're going to go right back to doing the same shit. They're going to go right back to doing the same thing. Spirit, clarify this Knight of Cups, please. Thank you. Yeah, the Emperor. For somebody you're dealing with, and I told you that this person was telling you half truths, this person is married. Could be an Aries, but this person has a wife or a husband just the same. They lying. Don't believe the hype. Don't believe the hype. This person is a lying sack of shit. All they do is lie. Spirit, tell me more about this married ass man. Thank you, Spirit. Yeah. So this person has you in a mental prison. Because you're always mentally fucked up. You're mentally exhausted. You're mentally overwhelmed. Because this person disappear on you a lot. That's why thief is here as well. This person disappears on you a lot. This person abandons you a lot. And then you're missing this person. Okay? And, and this person comes through. Sucks all the energy out of you. Fuck on you. Lay up with you. And then this person abandons you and disappears on you. And you don't understand why this person keep doing this to you. You don't understand why this person will come over here and lay with you and be with you. But then after this person leave the house, they disappear on you for days, weeks at a time. For some of y'all, even months. And then they pop back up in your life. Want to love bomb you. And you asking questions. And they telling you half truth and lies about some shit because they don't want you to know why they're really disappearing and staying gone for certain long periods of time. And the reason why is because they ass is married. Okay? This person is fucking married. Spirit, what else does Capricorn need to know? Look at her. Look at her. Look at her. You guys are going to be brought to awareness. You guys are going to find this shit out. And this shit is going to come to light. You see that? This person watches you on social media or something like that. And for somebody, you have history with this person. This is somebody that you know that you used to deal with or that you got a lot of history with, okay? And this person got a whole husband or a whole wife at home. And they not saying nothing about it. They keep on lying to you about it, okay? That's what's going on right now, Capricorn. For some of y'all, y'all dealing with somebody that's married already. Or this person is in a long-term relationship. And they've been in a relationship with this person for so damn long. That it seems like that they're in a marriage, okay? But it could be a marriage or a long-ass relationship that they've been in for years and years and years, all right? I told y'all that this person is not letting their true intentions be known. And this person's true intentions is that they just want to fuck around. But like I said, forces beyond your control are going to intervene with this whole entire situation, and I'm, and I'm feeling like that he just did because spirit just let you know that this person treats you the way that they do and disappear on you the way that they do and don't want you to come to their house and shit like that because they fuck with somebody else. And for some of them, they got a motherfucking wife or a motherfucking husband. All right? Spirit, may I please have a word of advice for Capricorn, please? Show me clearly. What does Capricorn need to know, spirit? Thank you. Yes, you guys are on a journey right now. Spirit says, do not fear leaving everything familiar to you behind and entering into the unknown. It's safe for you to take that risk. This is a personal journey for you guys. And this person can't go with you. This person can't go with you. This is a personal journey, okay? And this journey is going to bring you a whole lot of this right here. This personal journey is going to bring you a whole lot of money right here. It's going to bring you all this money and success that I saw on the table, okay? But you first have to take that risk, guys. This journey has already begun. 
but don't be afraid to take these risks, okay? I know taking a risk can be scary sometimes, especially when we don't quite know what's going to happen. It can be scary sometimes, but just the same, Spirit is letting you know it's safe for you to take that risk, okay? It's safe for you to risk to take this risk because when you take this risk, it's going to open up the doors for your success and all of this money right here. Guys, I hope you enjoyed this message for today. If anybody would like to book a personal reading with me, I will leave the link down in the description box below, especially if this reading resonated with anybody and you might feel like you want a personal reading for yourself to see what else is really going on. Go ahead and click that link. Go ahead and click that like button for me if you enjoyed this video. And if you haven't already subscribed to my channel, go ahead and click that subscribe button for me. I speak peace, love, and light over everybody that's watching this video today. I share.